Yeah, yeah. Come and do, uh, come and do a thing with more. Come and do a Q and A with more Dean, fam. Come go over here. I will do a Q and A with more Dean, fam. What's the comment saying? Where do you want to stand, my G? Hey, they might ask you some rude shit, some foul shit, no, you know, fam. No, no problem, man. And the haters are gonna hate, no matter yeah. what you do, bro. Anyway, where, anyway. Where do you want to stand, G? Yeah, anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you can choose, go. choose, choose. I, I, you just do your thing until the questions start coming in. It man ain't got no questions yet, still. Uh, basically, a man's gonna stand on the fence because you never know who could run up on me behind me, innit? So, man got to on the fence. You know them ones there, I think. Are you still? Yeah. But man, try, man, try come up like. I will be like, Shaitan, Jim, Bismillah, Rahman, Rahim. I've got a couple questions still. Go on. Um, when's your mixtape coming out? Uh, mixtape. I got a cool Conan, a uh, Krypton Conan still. Let's see what they're saying. Uh, and then man, there, what's it? Was six seven and the man there. Who else wants to do a mixtape with me? Uh, yeah, the man there, isn't it? Um, what's his name? Big up, big up, young spray. I saw he got stabbed the other day. Yeah. Yeah. Big up, young spray. He's a soldier, bro. That guy. How can they stab young spray? That's a guy, bro. Yeah. So big up, young spray. Hope you get. He's well anyway. You can't. You know, last protecting him still. Yeah. Um. Silence. 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 Now still in the speak says how old is he? Huh? They want to know how old you are. She said, don't watch my age, like, that's, that's why I ask, I don't even ask chicks that, it's rude, you get me? I said, don't ask that. I'm, I, I was joking, there's nothing wrong with that, there's nothing wrong with asking that, I'm joking, but she said, what, are you trying to chat smile or something, I'm joking. I'm telling you, there's, gonna be, uh, there's some rude questions coming in, you know, fam, what are you saying, anything, anything goes? Right, if it's rude questions, yeah, like... You don't want it, you don't want it. Obviously, the man are keyboard warriors, there. Yeah. What, fight? Mm, I want to fight him. Talking about the, the, the what happened in history. Okay. Yeah. So what? 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 What's man saying? That what? Shall I do my thing or what? Shall I just wait for questions? Is that question time now? Yeah. yeah people are asking questions. Yeah. Still. Ask questions. I got love for people, innit? it? Yeah. I'm people's guy, bro. But that's what I'm saying. I don't, like, I don't know. I don't know if you're ready for them questions. What they're sending for this? What's that? Mo Dean. Are you saying you want to marry me? I'll, I'll give her my you number. You said that, you said that. He's gassing. Are you married? No, I swear down, I swear down. He's gassing, he's gassing. Oh my gosh, man. This guy. They're no, looking for your wife for that. Yeah, no, no. come on. No. Hey, that's, what, then that's a good question, that's a good topic. I want to talk about that yeah, marriage thing. That, you know? you when you're ready, when, when, the, when the question's finished, I'm going to talk about something. Ain't going to front, I'm, sh I'm shook to ask some of these questions, you know. I was shook, you know. Don't be shook on no one, This is not random. Alright, cool. Um, Real TV arcs, oh, arcs that... asking for beats as well. Bro, come on, I'll beat your wife, man. <laughs> you know how it is. I said he'll beat your wife. He said he'll beat your wife, brother. Yeah, that you're asking them questions. My uh, question. Dingo, Jiu Jitsu, wait, well, ain't a question, it's a statement. Man, see, you don't look Muslim. Who said that? Dingo, Jitsu. Tell me, don't sound Muslim. And said, you don't sound Muslim. Yeah. You ain't asked, what you said, LEGR, you want to answer some questions yeah. here? <laughs> Go over there, fam. Let Maldine answer, fam. Well, Dean, I really, bro, still, I've told you for a bit, but I can see you have a pure heart. Same Some C4 yeah, Blaster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who said that? C4 Same Blaster. Big up C4 yeah, Blaster. Yeah, yeah. Well, Dean, are you the next Nelly from <laughs> Sally Jones? Are you the next hey, come, Nelly, get, 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 let's, let's get some serious questions, man. Well, Dean, what's your favourite kebab from Jordan M? What's your favourite kebab, brother? Like, man, we don't want to talk about food right now, because man, we want to talk Ask about Maldine, spiritual food. Ask Maldine, do a rap for us. Serious question, man. Well, Dean, are you still chopping up? To white, that point four. <laughs> Nothing. Man, I'll, That's hey. Vegeta. Maldine, my Maldine is sick of something wrong with you. Maldine, how many new uh, marriages? <laughs> and I'm walking the two still. Maldine, do you rate your fade still? Jim looking fresh. Oh, I see for a glass. Oh, What's up, love? What's up, love? Yeah. 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 Now, people love, love him on there still, yeah. but you know in, in COE fam, you get equal amount of love and hate still. Yeah, come on, man. Everybody no. does, even me fam. Even I, I imagine that on my own channel I get hate fam. Can we do that shit? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we got Dean, he's funny. Can anyone yes, translate yes, yes. please? See someone dissing me fam, can anyone translate? What are you saying, you can't hear what I'm saying or you can't hear what Maldine's saying? You better find a channel where you can listen to still. Yeah, yeah, I'm waiting. I'm after the questions, I'm Is this guy serious or is he a parody? I, I, who's the guy behind the camera? That's Ali Jihad. Ali Jihadi. No, 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 not jihad or that, Ali Jihad. Ali Jihad. Yeah, right. What's no, the, what's the no, I at the end, you know what I mean? I don't get nicked. everyone apologise on camera. Uh, no, it's... Let's see, let's see, good answer. Finally, an intellectual. Hold on. Let's talk about it, let's talk about it. Maldine's the only one in front of the camera, fam. Let's see, let's see. 
What's this guy's ethnicity? What's your ethnicity? What's your ethnicity? Uh, man's Arab stock. From Zaddy Radio, where? Which 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 part? Which part nah, over there? I'm, I'm mixed, bro. I got I got Saudi, I got Yemen, I got Iraq. You get me? Okay. Mixed. Ask him if he would date see alive. You know see alive? Huh? She's on YouTube out. Someone asked if you would date her, Jay Boogie. Someone asked me if I'm alive. If, you know, if, you, if you would date, I see her live. Yeah, a chick, is she a puff to me? She's, on, she's in a car, you ain't never seen her in, in none of the YouTube. No, I'll give her my number. Fam. She got one channel. <laughs> yeah, bro, I'm, man's here, man's trying to get married out here. What? That's why I want to talk about stuff. And so, what football team you support from Michael Bridges? Come on, bro, they, like football, I don't waste my time with that. I'm just looking forward to getting married and that, you get me? What, what football, bro? Man, see me, yeah? It's like my marriage. After, as soon as I get married, I'm not coming to the park again. Inshallah. What? Okay. As soon as my the only reason I'm here is because I'm not married. Isn't it? Once that man's man gets married, it's over. Bro. You won't see man here. Well, again. She's not gonna let you out. No, I'm just gonna be chilling with my wife and that all the time, isn't it? Yeah, we should not give you a headache. Nah, but I only come here because <laughs> man's single and that. So you know. What, what, what's your right. So that's, that answers the next question from Ricky Sydney. Asked how many wives you got? Well, yeah, yeah, no, no I should, what, 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 what? How many wives I got not right yeah. now? Yeah. Right now, no, no, right now, no wife, not like no wife. No. I still need speak, socks. How, how do you deal with the haters? Oh, the haters, yeah. Basically, where it is, yeah. Like man, like Fusi Tube and that, yeah. He gave yeah, real TV. His... Ain't even asking that from you. Going too deep. Yeah, go on, keep going. Keep man, going. like Fusi Tube's got 10 million subscribers and another, oh, yeah. I don't know how many million. He gave away all his challenges and went mental just because of comments. He goes, I read comments and I, I started getting upset because it hurts me. And he left YouTube, like Fusi Tube, yeah. I'm not, come on, bro. I'm not like Fusi Tube, bro. Man's a believer out here. Man, believe it. What, what's that comment gonna do, blood? Where's nothing? I know these men are all waste man, keyboard wearers, bashing at home every day 24 7. They have a life, uh, this in man. Come on, fam, they're not gonna affect me, my G. When I come here and I see, and I'm real life, I know the real guys out here, and they look into my eyes, they know our man's real. When they look into my eyes, yeah, and I look into their eyes, I know it's realness, bro. But when there's a fake guy sitting at home, this in man, that doesn't affect me, bro. Mm. That can be any pagan. You get me? Any waste man. Any waste man, blood. Like, you're so wasted. Man chills with rats and that. Rats, not, not, I mean, rats, like, I mean, my, our guy, our bridging. I mean, he chills, with, he chills in the sewers, bro. We well, say, hey, what, does, does Rap Boy call himself Rap Boy now? Cause I see someone coming in as, as Rap Boy. No, Splinter. 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 Master Rap, Splinter. Boy, he's acknowledged his name, yeah? Okay. But he doesn't really, it's like, you, only if you're his proper bridging, you can probably call him that. You understand? Okay. Or if you're his I, up, like that. I, 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 next, next one from. Um, the Shaheen asks, have you thought about removing the tattoos? Yeah, of course, bro. Look, look, look what I did, bro. I'm going to tell you the truth, you man. Yeah, look, it's not a joke out here. I brought, uh, 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 three days ago, there's a, there's a plaster here, yeah? Look, uh, I lifted up, um, I, I got a burnt a spoon, a hot spoon from the oven, yeah. and I, I, I heated it and I stuck it on here, the tattoo. And I tried to burn the tattoo off, but it didn't come off, yeah? As you can see, I put a plaster. I tried doing it on here, I'm trying to move it slowly, we're burning it, but it's not working here. Are you going to fuck yourself thing. up, man? No, no, I tried to go to the laser thing, yeah. they got our free trial for laser in the Tottenham Court Road. I went in the room, the woman done the laser thing, yeah. it went, yeah. the thing went, yeah? Yeah, yeah? I was like, shit. And as soon as I come out, it came back. It came back. I said, what? She goes, no, it takes one year and it, and it costs you a thousand pounds just we for like... You have to keep doing it. You got to keep doing it. So listen to me, fuck that. I went home, got the spoon, started burning up the thing. But obviously it's not working, bro. So, so why, 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 did, why did you get why did you get them in the first place? Bro, I got them because I I, I I wasn't thinking straight, bro. Okay, so it was not happening. I was. It's the past year. It's, I regret, but what can you do? You just gotta live with your what you regret, bro. If you mistake, it's, it's better than like. It's better than hurting people. You're hurting myself, innit? I'm not hurting no one else, innit? I love the spoon thing, bro. That's yeah, the spoon thing, I need to stop that, bro, because it's bare infections and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can see that fucking coming off. I had to pull the thing off and everything. Yeah, Trying to pull it off. Is that his wife's name? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the goal. That's the goal. That's the goal, yeah. That's the first goal. Hey, Real TV asks if you're going to fight Hassan. I see you, David, he was looking like you went to move to Hassan's store. Hassan no, was looking lonely today. Real TV, real TV, right? basically Hassan. What are you saying? You know real TV here? Yeah, where's your hater? I don't know, who, but I got a lot of haters. I don't, I, don't, I don't really watch the haters. But what I'm trying to say, mashallah, you get me like, uh, everyone's got haters. Everyone who's real has got haters, bruv. If you ain't got haters, then something wrong with you, bruv. The something is not right, bruv. What I'm trying to say is I would never initiate a fight, bruv. I would never start on anyone, no matter who they are. But when someone tells me, I don't care if he's a flipping boxer, he tells me, listen, bruv, I want to fight you. Come and go. I'm accepting this challenge. Shit, that's what Hassan did to me. He said to me, yo, Mo, I want to fight you. That's exactly what he said to me. Come and go around the corner, he said. Oh, he started on you, yeah? He started to me. So once, once he said that, 
I said, all right, I'll accept your challenge, let's go. He said to me, no, before we, before we scuff, sign, this pa sign a paper. He never brought me the paper, but he said, there's a paper I want you to sign. Once you sign this paper, me and you are going around the corner, we're scuffing it. That's what happened. And you can ask him and he'll tell you. Yeah, he is. He's a, he's a pagan, isn't he? He's an Agan. Pagan thing. You know? If you want to see a pagan, you look at that guy, bro. That's what a pagan looks like. But well, obviously there's a lot of pagans these days, so you don't, it's, it's, there's pagans in disguise. There's pagans wearing masks, there's pagans everywhere, you just don't know. It's when they're not, when the end of times, bro, where, where, where it's, everything's mixed up, it's mixed up. You don't know who's, you don't, right is mixed with wrong, it's mad. It, it's mad when the end times, bro, it's gonna kicking off, bro. Just get ready, it's gonna kick off. I'm telling you this right now. So I don't know what man is, Man is sitting there, yeah, get ready, bro, spiritually, get ready mentally, get ready physically. It's kicking off, bro. Whoever, wherever you are, bro, it's kicking off. Just get ready. Inshallah, isn't it, man? Just stand it like, that's what I'm saying. But what, what do you want to say to say, oh, brother? I'm looking for the comments, though. I'm just saying, let us diss each other. Hey, yo, I got, my comments are immature, fam. I mean, I'm, I'm trying to find a, a proper one. Because you said I wanted to say a couple of things. Do you want I was me asking to, me questions. Do you want me to, 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 to say a couple of say, things? Say, say your thing until I find a, until right. I find a question. Every time you find a question, ask one, yeah? yeah. All right, what? Shall I, see, oh, shall I wear my jacket or should I take it off? What's better? Hey, fam, do what you want, fam. Right. Do what you want, fam. Right. you got to ask me that shit, fam. All right. All right. Basically, no, basically, I'll ask you because just say... What do you mean, how he looks on the camera? Yeah, yeah. No one don't care about none of that, fam. Keep no, it no, real no, and show No, 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 how he looks on that, that. Winter soldiers are here, bro. All right, it's a winter thing, yeah? All right, listen. Basically, yeah, once man gets married, inshallah, yeah, uh, that's the most important thing. That's why I'm advising everyone here to get married. Anyone who's not married, the first thing you do tonight, go to your mum. If you ain't got a mum or, or something, go to your dad. If you ain't got a dad, go to your auntie. If you ain't got auntie, go to someone in your family. Say, listen, find me someone to marry because I need to get married right now. Not tomorrow, now. And then they phone up the chick, they say, listen, he got one. You need to be stable as well, though. Yeah, I'll come, listen. Listen, 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 let me do it. So when you get married ASAP, blood, it's not, I'm not joking with you, I'm telling you, get married, blood. I'm saying to you now, blood, if you can get married this week, even if you have to travel back to your home country, book your ticket now, blood. Book it now. Go on um, Sky Scanner and book the thing. Find the chick, yeah? Because, you know, back home, the chicks, there, they're, they're, they're simple. They accept you, innit? Anything, blood. I, I, I've got a question still, um, from Jordan M. I think this brother comes to the park by his profile picture. He um, figures a Muslim, a white brother. He says, Maldine, what's your opinion on transgender toilets? Boy, that's, what kind of question is that, man? Oh, transgender toilets? Yeah. But obviously, but, but no, but, but that's a mad question, blood. I, 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 how am I going to answer that question, bro? I don't even know what... Transcendental You know, they're, they're, trying to, they're trying to make toilets where uh, one anyone, anyone can go in. Right, that's the least of our problems that? right now. Bro. Oh, yeah, beautiful London. Yeah. Say, why one right, we got bare problems. You're telling me about this problem. There's too many problems out here, Aki. A man's got a gun in his. Anytime you see me wearing a glove, boy, but I know I've got the gun in my boxes. Man got the thing in my pocket. Smash it and take out your eye socket. No, yeah. I will move like a rocket. I saw the one glove, bang, bang, so they don't leave no fingerprints on that thing in the pocket. Oh, yeah. that camera don't clock it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, what? Uh, no, uh, brother, that question. Man said, where's the other glove? Joe Hip. Brother, that question about transgenders and all that, well, that's the least of our problems. Man's talking about marriage right now. Man's talking about now, booking a ticket, flight scanner, going out there, getting your wife, getting you, you get me? Getting married, blood. Because if you, because the Prophet Muhammad said, I said, him, so are youth. He said to him, are you married? The youth said, no. He said, do you work? They said, no. And then the prophet was, was sad. You get me? That most of the people of hell are the single people. Remember this, bro. I'm listen, listen to what I'm telling you. The most of the people of hell are the single. The most people, the worst of you are the single. This is the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said. When you pray, a married man, his salah is 70 times better than a non-married man. There are so many hadiths about getting married, right? And you men are out here. And even from the Imams, there's a hadith saying, I do not want the whole world and what is in it, and I sleep one night without a wife. And you man are out here sitting, telling me this, this, that, come on, man needs to get married now, blood. It's not a joke, this is an emergency situation, bro. Emergency, like, like that, you should be like this, like that, looking like that. No more, the only thing on your mind is getting married, fam. Nothing else. Come on, fam. What are you telling me what, what, what are you telling me? Is there anyone got any, like, that's what I'm trying to give advice to the man. Because it's not, there's no time, plan. we need to make kids, the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi said, make a lot of kids because uh, that's a ilaha illallah. So, so in the day of judgment, I can be proud of my ummah, a lot of ummah. Even if you, some people that had kids and the kids fell down miscarriage, even that will be accepted. Allah will bring that kid up 
and he will he will make blessings for you even if you had the miscarriage or you dropped the kid or something also divorce i hear a lot of brothers getting divorced these days I, i'm not gonna tell i'm not gonna lie my brethren's calling me he wants to get divorced some next people getting divorced come on why are you getting divorced for fam are you mad the throne of allah shakes when you get divorced are you mad the throne man are getting divorced over money mostly over some madness fam the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Jibra'il came to me and advised me so much about the woman that I thought that I should never divorce a woman unless she does a big fornication, like a big adultery or fornication. Only in that time I divorced her. Other than that, why are you divorcing her over some minor thing? Oh, if she dissed you or she said something about your mom, so what? She's a woman, innit? Women get angry. Women, their brain is not exactly like 100% like that. When they get emotional, they might dish you, they might dish your granddad, they might dish your whole generation. Don't take them like that. Just say, yeah, yeah, whatever. All right, cool, cool, keep it sweet. You understand? Just walk away. Don't be divorcing over some stupidness, fam. Because once you come, I, I'm telling you, fam, I'm telling you, divorce is the worst thing that destroys, uh, uh, destroys society. The kids, they don't know what's going on with their parents. You're messing up families, fam. You just stay married, stay, just keep your wife, blood. You let her diss you 24 7, just stay calm. Hey, Ahmed Ali's in, in, in the comments. He said something about false hadith, fam. Ahmed Ali? Yeah, yeah, yeah. First of all, Ahmed Ali, yeah. I don't. Because this guy is like a shaitan, bro. I have to just. I'm a shaitan regime. I have to. I have to. Because man come like a shaitan to me, like out of nowhere, yeah? Man's talking to you. For, man comes with negative vibes. Ahmed Ali comes with negativity. He doesn't come with blessings. And the way he talks, not a little. He doesn't talk like, a, like with blessings. He comes, talks like, subhanAllah, I don't know, but subhanAllah, I feel, I feel, I see darkness in him. I see evil in him. I see evil, bro. So when man come to me, man needs to come with more, man needs to change himself, inshallah. We need, all need to change ourselves. I need to change myself. But man needs, he, he needs some, I don't know what he needs, but I'll do the blame shaitan regime, innit? I'll do the blame shaitan regime. I'll do the blame shaitan regime. That's what I'm going to say. I respect you. Yeah. I, Ahmed, I, like, Ahmed Ali, guys. just leave me alone, innit? I'll do the blame shaitan regime. Don't follow me like that. Don't come to, go to someone else. Go to someone else. I'm not feeling, I don't really like evil, bruv. One guy is still. Oh, no, I'm going near, but I'm telling you. Yeah, yes. Respect. So, respect. So, what, I'm, what? Where respect? Yeah? Where's respect? I oh, know, no, I was just aiming at my brother, just leaving still. Respect's doing a live show now, though, still. Where? He's doing it online, isn't he? He's online. Oh, big up respect, show. yeah. Um, hey, man, what do you do for a living? Bro, what I'm doing for a living, yeah, is that, alhamdulillah, I'm not in prison. Alhamdulillah, I'm not dead. Alhamdulillah, I'm not in hospital. Well, at the moment, that's alhamdulillah for me. That's, that's a living right now. You understand? That's 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 a blessing for me, you know. That's a blessing for right now. And that man is to do something product productive, inshallah. So you won't see me no more in the park. You know, you know, Mr. Abdi. Mr. Abdi is in there laughing, fam. He's trying to mock the thing, you know. He's been asking very rude questions as well, fam. May Allah curse him if he's asking rude questions. May Allah destroy him, inshallah. If he's trying to. Yes, my brother. Yeah. May Allah destroy him straight like that. If he's sending negative energy, inshallah, the negative energy comes back a thousand times on Mr. Abdi. Thousand. Not one time, not two times, thousand. Because you're sending my negative energy. Why are you sending my negative energy? Do you see me sending you a negative energy? Why Why do you have to be a hate of them? You said it ain't rude still, but I don't know. I, I, man's asking about the wife and all of them things there, you get me? Come on, fam. That man's here. You see, man, talking real. I'm defending the poor, the oppressed, the people around the world. I'm here trying to speak for the people that that, that are oppressed, fam. I'm not here to do... To, to, but soon you're not going to see me here no more. That's, this might be my last day, fam. No more in no the high park, fam. Man will be go, man will be out the ends, fam. Go far away, live my life, bro. I can't be living like this. Going here, fam. Respect you understand? Man, I safe, man. man can't be living like this all the time, all this hype, bro. But what, what I was trying to say to the man, them, yeah. Obviously, I come with. I wanted to talk about some. Saying Jake's are still on the ends, yeah. Hey, man's gonna wrap up soon, you know, fam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, man, I wanted to talk some historical facts, yeah. I don't know. You wanna hear them or? Quran. What is it? Is it? Um, do some Quran stories. All right, no, no, no. You know what? Look, listen, yeah. Basically, let me tell you something, yeah. I want to talk about something still uh, history times, but I'm gonna leave it. If it's gonna be like the, I was gonna talk about like the split between the Muslims. Like right now. Obviously, you mean what? What the the Shia and the Sunni? Yeah, yeah. All right. Basically, look. Right now, we're all sad because Imam Hussein in it. He got killed in it in Karbala. Yeah, he got chopped up. Yeah. Obviously, he got chopped up by Yazid and his uh, son of Maawiya, son of Abu Sufyan. Yeah. And everyone's sad in this month. We're all sad. We cry, like it's a sad month. It's not a month for partying or being happy or so. So obviously, uh, the respect to the Holy Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Obviously, we respect his grandson as well. 
respect that's respecting the prophet so all the historical events that have happened there's obviously people that follow Yazid and like Yazid who is a criminal who raped and killed women and and was a drinker of alcohol and was an evil person so Imam Hussain who's the grandson of the Prophet Muhammad he had to stop he had to not give bait at him not give allegiance. so obviously there's people Muslims today that are following Yazid these kind of Muslims are the most disgusting filthy Muslims ever in the universe how can you follow Yazid how can you like Yazid who was the one who killed thousands of Sahabas he raped thousands of women he destroyed the Kaaba, he drank alcohol, he was a pagan. Yeah? You disagree with Yazid? <laughs> Who do you, where did you get references from? Yazid? Come in. Yazid? No, but you do, do, are you against Yazid? Yeah, I guess well, that's, that's, that's what we're saying. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're saying. That's what. That, that's what. No, no, no. He's not a Sahabi, Yazid. It's, it's Hussein versus Yazid. Whose side you on? You have to choose a side, bro. There's no in between, bro. You're, you're either with Hussein or you're with Yazid. Which one are you? With Hussein or with Yazid? Yeah. Are you with the grandson of the Prophet or the grandson of Abu Sufyan? Who are you with? Brother, it's like saying I'm with Pharaoh and I'm with Moses. I'm with both of them. How? How does that work? No, it's not. It's not. I'm just... Can I ask you, how did he see himself by his hands? Bro, his army did it. His army. Yeah, but it's orders from him. Yeah, on the orders from him. They, they was all telling Imam Hussain, give bay'ah to Yazid. Imam Hussain said, I will not give bay'ah to him. Under orders of Ibn Ziyad. Yeah, but Ibn Ziyad was taking it from... So when Ibn Ziyad did it, how come, how come he told him, Ibn Ziyad, if only you had to kill him, only you knew him. Huh? You would not have to put a hair on it. Uh, Rabbi, uh, historical fact. That, he did not say that. Rabbi, historical fact. Oh, Sunnah and Shia. Yazid took Hussein. This is historical fact. There's no, there's no. Okay, is, why is that? There's mentioned? no denying it. Why is that mentioned? It's mentioned in every box, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you, what I said, why is that mentioned? Why is that mentioned? Yes, that Yazid was regretting what Ibn Ziyad did. Then Rabbi, why, how could you? Yazid was telling even Yazid, the own person who's killing Imam Hussein, he knows that Imam Hussein is the grandson well, of the what Prophet. The, what is the orders he, given, he gave to Ibn Ziyad? Said, they said, bring when me. When you go there, do not touch him, right? No, no. He said, give me bay'ah for Hussein. If you don't give me bay'ah, bring me his head. Okay, this is, they brought his head back. This was the time we asked Allah to forgive them for what happened. You you are, bro, but you can't. But you're ignoring what, you're ignoring what I'm saying. You didn't hear me. Yeah. Right? Oh. Did you hear me? I'm listening. You said specifically Yazid. You said you're Yazid or yeah, them. You yeah. said either Musa or Pharaoh. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, straight. That's the problem. What you said now is not agreeing with what the historical. That's concept. what the Quran says, though. The Quran says you're either with truth or you're with falsehood. You can't stand in the middle and say, yeah, I want to be, I want to mix it up. I can that game, I can say either you're with Ali, you're with Abu Bakr, or either with you're Abu Bakr or with Uthman. It, it's going to go on like this. It's going to create fitna. Yeah, but, but, okay. But, no, 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 one second. With the Abu Bakr and Ali, that's a fitna, yeah? Yes. But with Yazid, there's no fitna. It's clear cut, bro. It's clear cut. The guy was killing. <laughs> Yazid is just Yazid, bro. It's not, it's not, you can't, Yazid can't compare no, him. With, I, I didn't say Yazid was a perfect. No, I'm saying you can't compare him with the other guys. He's no, no, too no, much. I'm not comparing him. He's I'm too evil, about, bro. You're right on that point. But I'm talking specifically on what you said the claim. We have Yazid actually regretting what Ibn Ziyad did. Now, Ibn Ziyad did an evil act, I agree. And he was wrong to do that. But I'm, I'm, bro, bro, I'm but I say, say, by, say when Imam Mahdi Yazid comes. Yeah, you know Imam Mahdi? You know Imam Mahdi? When he, Imam Mahdi, you know him? Yeah. When Imam Mahdi comes, he's gonna take revenge for, for for the people that love Yazid. Just for them loving Yazid, he's gonna chop their heads. Off. I never said I love Yazid. No, no, I'm not saying about you. I'm not saying about you. There are people in Saudi and other countries, terrorist people. Show me, show me. There are Saudi sheikhs that love Yazid. That's a big claim to make. I can say the same thing in Iran. No, you're right. They yeah, love Yazid. No, no, I can say there's people who love Ali so much that they worship him as a god. That, they're not Muslim, bro. Yeah. Anyone who worships Imam Ali is not Muslim. They, they say, yeah, worship yeah. Allah only. But, That's yeah, it. We but, know this. But, but what I'm trying to say. Oh, imagine if I said, yeah, Yazid. Then you don't no, say no. I'm, uh, I'm worshiping. No, no, bro, bro. Listen, listen. In the Quran, Joseph, uh, Jacob's, uh, Joseph's dad, he said, oh, Joseph, ya asafi ala Yusuf. If I say, oh, my dad, oh, my brother, just say you're someone whose brother has died. And he said, oh, my brother, Matthew. He remembers him. This is not mean he's worshipping him. He's remembering him. Who is he complaining to? No, he's not complaining to him, bro. He's, he's mentioning anyone. Okay, but That's the, this, is, this is the problem with the Muslims today. Okay, okay. If you remember someone, it doesn't mean you're worshipping them. If I say, oh, my mom, uh, Sandra, oh, that. my brother, I, I Alex. Said, I never said you could remember Ali. I didn't say that shit. Yeah. I'm talking about when you say and you see, yeah, Ali, my dad, my dad helped. All right, let me explain to you. Let me explain to you. What is what is a pagan? A pagan is putting a god other than Allah, right? And asking them for help. Well, like also, let me just let me finish. Let me finish. So a pagan is asking for help for gods other than Allah, or worshiping other than Allah, right? Or saying there's two or three. So that's a pagan, but this, this is this is this. Allah will not forgive this, right? Uh, now, a Muslim is someone who says La ilaha illallah Muhammad and worships Allah. Okay, okay. 
Now, there's a difference. There's a difference in the Muslim schools of thoughts. You've got some Sufi, you've got some different thing, where they say that there's shafa'a, the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, because there's a Quran, there's verses about shafa'a, that the, the Prophet can do shafa'a for people, and this is in the Quran. It's in the Quran, bro. No, he can do shifa. Okay, right so, now. No, no, because because what it is, no, brother, what it is, you saying that the prophet is dead goes against what Allah saying, because Allah saying Belhum Ahya. So Allah saying they're alive, you're saying they're dead. There's a difference of opinion on whether they are could they hear you. Yeah, like Moses is in the grave and Sahih Bukhari says Moses is praying in his grave. The dead can hear you. But what I'm trying to say, what I'm trying to say, this does not take you, this is not like a major shirk, like saying, you didn't finish the shirk, what did you say? The, 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 yeah, this is, they're with the Lord. They're going to. They're alive, they're alive, what? It doesn't say No, no, there's, Allah. there's one, there's Allah. Okay, where is Allah? But that does not mean Allah is. Okay, where is Allah? Okay, good question, where is Allah? You're saying they're alive with Allah, where is Allah? No, no, that's shirk, now you've done shirk. Because the, the, the four schools of so the, the, the four schools of so has said whoever says Allah is in a certain place is done shirk. Whoever says he's up is done shirk. I never said he's up. No, you've just said he's up the heavens. This is he's above. He's above there, so you're saying they're over there. That's shirk. Yeah, and he's outside. No, no, no. This is see that's the thing. Are you saying he's brother, everywhere? Else? Brother, that, that's the thing. Yeah, he is everywhere, but he's not everywhere. In a way, I'm gonna explain to you. No, but I'm gonna explain. No, no, no but, but I'm, I'm gonna explain to you. When you want it, no, but what I'm trying to say is now this, now we've gone into another topic. Now what you, what I want you to do now is to go and make some research. When you go home tonight, go on Imam Ali describes Allah. Description of Allah. You will find the description, you'll start crying because you will never find anyone. Exactly. No, I'm just saying. Where did this come from? I heard, I heard, uh, yeah, I, want, I, want, I want to go say peace to everyone, man. I'm cutting you know. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to come back though. I'm going to say peace to everyone.